Hello everyone. So a few days ago, Game Informer released an article that revealed the Arc Strider subclass tree. So let's take a look at the brand new Hunter subclass. So first off, the original grenades are coming back. That's Flux, Arc Bolt, and Skip Grenades. The jumps are High Jump, Strafe Jump, which is like an increased control, and then Triple Jump. This means that Blink is no longer available for the Hunter class. Not sure if the Void Rocker subclass will have Blink as well, we're just gonna have to wait and see. The class ability is the Dodge, just like we saw on the Gunslinger subclass. The dodges are called Marksman's Dodge and Gambler's Dodge. Choosing Marksman's Dodge automatically reloads your weapon after you dodge, and choosing Gambler's Dodge generates melee energy when dodging your enemies. The super is called Arc Staff, which is a bow staff that you swing around killing your enemies with, which is very similar to the Blade Dancer, being that it's a melee based attack. It was stated that the Arc Strider feels better to control than the Blade Dancer. The Blade Dancer was kind of unpredictable regarding which direction your enemy was, which made you waste super energy when trying to get a kill, although this was more of a PvP problem than PvE. With the subclass, it will be easier to get a kill and then switch to a person that might be behind you or near the person you just killed. The subclass trees are as follows. The first tree is called Way of the Wind. The melee is called Disorienting Blow. When you hit your target, you will blind them similar to the effect from the Titan Flashman grenade. Killing an enemy with Disorienting Blow will fully recharge it. Lightning Reflexes gives you the ability to take less damage while dodging when your super is active. Focus Breathing makes it so sprinting reduces the cooldown of your dodge and your sprint speed is also increased. And lastly, there's Battle Meditation, where when you are critically wounded, your melee and grenades recharge significantly faster. The other tree is called Way of the Warrior. This tree is for those agile hunters that love to dodge so much and confuse enemy players. The melee attack is called Shocking Blow. While using this, your melee emits lightning on strike, which is what I assume will be similar to the Warlock melee hopefully without the ridiculous range, or maybe like the Titan Stormfist. Combat Flow fully recharges your dodge after getting a melee kill. Deadly Reach gives your melee lunge extra range after dodging. And finally, we have Lethal Current, where after dodging, your melee attack hits twice. I would see this being more used for PvE when fighting a yellow health bar enemy. So when you dodge your attack, you can hit them twice for extra damage. And that is the new Arc Strider subclass. There wasn't any gameplay revealed, but I'm sure there will be some after E3 and I will definitely have some when the beta comes out. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and don't forget to subscribe for all things Destiny and I'll see you all next time.